computer. All right, everybody's finished the warm up. Now we're going to get right. started. Really good. All right, good. All right, you got a froth going. All right, so now we're going to go into jumping jacks planks. Those who've been doing this understand what I'm talking about. It's a plank. You're going to move one foot to the outside, then the other. Right? So, just move one to the outside, then the other. Keep your hips level, butt down. All right, you're going to do 20 with each leg. Ready? Everybody in plank position? Yep. And you can do it on your hands if you want, but you're down for a long time. Are we ready? Let's start with the right foot. Right, center. Yes. Left, center. Right, center. 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 Come on. Three. Three. Four. Four. How are we doing, Stu? Good. Good. Marley, you all right? It's easier than killing the jar, isn't it? Hey, Charlie, when I did kill the jar, I, at every campsite, I would try to do as many push ups as I could. That's a bad idea. It's a bad idea. Irv, you should do the deck of cards with me sometime on a Friday. <laughs> You mean, oh, you mean and push up deck of cards? Yeah. That thrill? No, no, no. Not anymore. We do it every Friday. Yeah, but my shoulder won't let me. <laughs> I can play <laughs> cards, but I can't do push ups. Well, you can do like a, a like a, like a, if you do a color is a certain thing. So something can be plank, something can be uh, ab, something can right. be something else. You can mix it up. Right, right. For the, you toss the card and that calls the exercise. All right. Let's get the deadlift going with the other leg. Grab one dumbbell. Your supportive device if you need it. And ready? Deadlift. Row down and back up. Deadlift. Row and up. Deadlift. Row. And up.
We ready? Dead lift, row, yeah. up. Go. Dead lift, row, up. Dead lift, row, up. Dead lift, row, up. Dead lift, row, So we're going to repeat the jumping jack planks. 20. You ready? Prop up on your elbows. Waiting for my brother Lydia and uh, Kelly, our hostess. Dustin, where is Brandon? I hadn't seen him in a week. All right. On this one, who's got shoulder problems? Aaron, I know you can't do the push ups, right? You got shoulder problems, Ben? Yeah? All right, you can't do too many push-ups? Oh, really? All right, 
For those who have shoulder problems, you can do bench press lying on your back. But for the rest of you, you're going to do 11 push-ups. Well, not really 11, 11 sets of push-ups. You're going to do one push-up and stand up. Then you're going to go down and do two push-ups, stand up. <laughs> then three, stand up. It adds up to 66, right? If you're doing bench press, you'll lie on your back, you'll do a bench press, one rep, pause, two reps, pause, three reps, pause, right? If push-ups are too much for your shoulder, you can, but you can do them, do them on your knees. So knees bent. All right, are we ready? Ready for push-ups, Ben? Cheyenne? Good. All right, down, one push-up. Down, and come back up. Good. Two push-ups. Down. Two push-ups, and come back up. Three push-ups. Down. Hold down to three. Four. Come down, get back to one and do four. Ready? Back up. Five. Down. One down, five. Back up. That was pretty brutal. Everybody good? So, we're going to do yep. some triceps, but it's a core exercise. You can be in a bridge position, lying on your back, relatively light dumbbells, anywhere from five to 10 pounds. You're going to raise your hips, put one leg out in front. So you're on one leg only. Your hands are over your shoulders. Step, step, step. 
We're going to get some floor first. Bring it up. 20 reps. Staying up the whole time. Ready? And down. Up. Down. Down. Up. Down. Down. Up. Down. Four. Down. Five. Down. Six. Down. chest stays up. Keep fluttering. Toes can be pulled back. They can point like a swimmer if you're a swimmer. Like martial artist, your toes can be pulled up. Five more seconds. And relax. All right, so my, my outline has us doing another round of the push-ups, but I think that's a little excessive. So let's just do another set of the bridge and tricep using the other leg. Line the back, other leg in the air, hands over the shoulders, ready to raise the hips, and hands down, and up. That's one, down, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, down, nine, down, ten, down, you can hit up, eleven, down, twelve, down, 14, down, 14, down, 15, down, 16, down, 17, down, 18, down, 19, down, and 20. Yeah. Put your hands together. Get ready for another 30 seconds of flutter. Ready? Go. Legs straight, fluttering from the hips. Knees stay straight the whole time. Take 10 seconds into it. Head and chest are up. Make sure the hands are under your rear end. That helps to stabilize your, or allows your abdominals to stabilize your spine. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and done. Good. All right, drink up. Hey, to do this right, so the whole video is shown, 
We may have to do the beginning part of the workout again. <laughs> the squats and lunges. <laughs> Hey, Irv, I mean this in the kindest way possible. Fuck you. <laughs> Only a good friend can say that. <laughs> That's right. We can let the women do it. You can sit still and watch, right? Indeed. Indeed. Because <laughs> Taylor can do it easily. Right, Taylor? There you go. A yeah, sexist right. comment and blow me up all in one sentence. What? All right. I said a now, sexist comment and blowing me up all in one sentence. I know, I know. <laughs> you do. I bet they could. I'm not challenging. My, my, my daughter's not listening, so it's okay. All right. Now, <laughs> well, thank you, Irv. Put in a chair or a stick. There you go. Me. Well, thank you, buddy. Much appreciated. Yeah, right. You leaving us? All right. We're going to do side kicks. So no. hold on to something. Have your knee up high, not too high. And you're going to do 55 side kicks, right? Keeping the knee elevated, pushing out with the heel. For those with martial arts experience, it's easy. For those who are new to it, it's not easy. It's a new chair to hold on to. Not yet, Aaron. Not yet, Aaron. Hang in there. Aaron, chill out, right? We ready? Diane and Ben, you guys want to share a chair, so to speak? Chair sharing? All right. So, again, the knee is up. Push the heel out. Your knee is going to stay up the whole time. Do 55. Go. It's not a kick. It's a push. Go. Do your 55. Straighten the knee out, Ben. Push the heel out. See how the foot is coming to the target. All right. And, and Ben and Cheyenne, don't try 55, just do 30. All right. You, you'll be too sore tomorrow. Can you see it? That's the idea, Ben. So you're leaning sideways, pushing the heel out towards the target. Justin, straighten the knee, but don't kick it. Just push it out. This is a good self-defense technique. Assuming the person pushes you up against the chair that's strong enough to hold you. Push the heel out. Taylor, keep the heel up. That's it, Charlie. You're letting your knee drop, Charlie. Keep your knee elevated. No, no, I got time. What? You done? I said I got tired. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, all right. Okay, well, now we're going to do a Krav Maga ground technique, right? So watch what I did. You're going to be on your back. You're going to do a bridge kick. Bridge kick. Bridge kick. But when you do this, bridge kick, and you're kicking somebody in the knee, or if you're flexible enough or they're short enough, to the groin. And you're pulling the foot back, so you kick them with the heel. But don't stop the knee. It's bridge, push out, down. Bridge, push out, down. Ready? On your back. On your back. By the count. Ready? Bridge, kick, back, down. That's one. Bridge, kick, back, two. Bridge, kick, back, three. Same leg. Bridge, kick, back, four. Bridge, kick, back, five. Bridge, kick, back, six. Bridge, kick, back, seven. Bridge, kick. Back, eight, bridge, kick, back, nine, bridge, kick, back, ten, bridge, kick, 
back, nine more, bridge, kick, back, throw, bridge, kick, back, 13, bridge, kick, back, 14, bridge, kick, back, 15, bridge, kick, back, 16, bridge, kick, back, 17, bridge, kick, back, 18, bridge, kick, back, 19, bridge, kick, back, 20. All right, since you're on your back, prop up on your side with one arm, elbow is bent, legs can be staggered or feet on top of each other. We're gonna do three 10 second side planks. All right, so you prop up on your forearm, which is at 90 degrees to your body, Raise your hips, hold it up there for 10 seconds. Go, one, two, three, four, five, six, your hand can be up if you want to, eight, nine, and relax. Up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and relax. And one more. Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and standing back up. Because you gotta do side kicks with the other leg. This is the last sequence. All right, get your chair or your wall or your broomstick or do it in midair. And let's start your side kick. Knee is up, push out and back. All right, but it stays up the whole time. Go ahead, do 55 for those who've been doing it, 30 for those who've not. Keep the knee up. Oh, that's good, Ben. Very good. Pull the toes back more. Aaron, keep your knee up. Charlie, you're drooping. Six. When you do these side kicks like this, it gets the hip abductors and it gets the obliques very well. So it's like a core exercise, but you come out of it with a little bit of a skill. Charlie, your knee looks like Bill Beekler's. It drops down. Keep it up there. I knew that would get you. <laughs> Where's your brother? Exactly. <laughs> All right. On the floor. There you go. The floor. All right. Well, now get down on the floor on your back. On your back. In a bridge position, knees are bent. And you're going to kick with the other leg. So you raise your hip, kick, back, and down. Ready? Go. One. Up. Kick. Back, down, up, two, down, or back, three, kick, down, back, four, kick, back, down, five, kick, back, down, six, kick, back, down, seven, kick, back, down, eight, kick, back, down, nine, kick, back, down, 10, kick, back, down, 11, kick, back, 
down, 12, kick, back, down, 13, kick, back, down, 14, kick, back, down, 15, kick, back, down, 16, kick, back, down, 17, kick, back, down, 18, kick, back, down, 19, kick, back, down, and 20, kick, back, and down. All right, now you're gonna do your side planks on the other side. Three for 10 seconds, get yourself in position, lying on your side, forearm is on the floor, feet can be staggered or on top of each other. Ready, lift. 10 second plank, side plank bend. Lift, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and down. And up, lift, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, down. And one more, lift, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and on your back for stretching. Now you get to relax, lying on your back. So you did fine. Nobody got hurt this time. We didn't do any jumping drills. I thought we were gonna have more arthritics today, but Becky and Beniche couldn't show up. <laughs> All right, so. Uh, this time, lying on your back, legs, one leg is flat, bring the, bring the right knee to your chest. Bring the right knee to your chest. Hold that stretch. Gradually pulling the thigh in closer to the belly. All right, bring your face up, kiss your knee, hold it there for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and relax it. Now, grab behind the right leg, grab, use your hands, grab your right thigh, bring your knee up to about 90 degrees or more if you're flexible, and straighten your knee out. So this time you're stretching the hamstring pretty hard. You're pulling the leg up, straight knee, keep it there. It takes about 10 to 15 seconds for a muscle to start thinking about relaxing into a stretch. Now pull into it a little bit more. Give yourself a little more tension. All right, now bring your face up towards your knee, bring your knee towards your face, keeping your leg as straight as you can. Keep the leg straight as possible. So you're getting hamstring, butt, and low back. And relax it. Now put the right foot on the outside of your left knee. Use your left hand to grab your right knee and pull it across your body, All right? So you're doing that basic yoga stretch, pulling the knee across the body. Your right arm is flat on the floor. The shoulder blade is touching the floor. If your shoulder's coming up off the floor, you're pulling your heart too hard on your hip. Just relax into that stretch. Take five deep breaths. Go ahead. One more. All right, now stay in that position, but bring your knee up closer to your stomach and chest. So your knee is more like a 90, more than 90 degrees up. And now push it down to the floor as much as you can with that left hand. So it locks in the lower spine, gives you a little more stretch on the upper thoracic spine. Hold that for five deep breaths. Great. Now, 
Bend both knees, come back to neutral, bend both knees, put your right ankle on your left knee. Right ankle on left knee and bring your left knee up, grab your thigh with both hands, grab your left thigh with both hands and do the piriformis stretch. Point it towards your chest. Think about trying to get that calf coming toward the right calf towards your chest. Hold that stretch. Gradually applying a little more tension each time. And now bring your face up to kiss your calf. So bring your head up off the floor, bringing your calf towards your head and vice versa. Hold that stretch, dig in deep. Kathy damn near hurt herself doing this the other day. And now relax. All right, straighten both legs out. Bring your left knee to your chest. Grab your uh, shin, pull it in towards your chest. Give it a little bit more tension. You should feel this in the glutes, a little bit in the low back. Bring your face up, kiss your knee. Come on up, kiss your knee, a little more stretch that way. And relax the tension. Now grab behind the left thigh with both hands, straighten your left knee. Straighten it out. And now apply tension so you feel a good stretch on the hamstring. If you want to, if you've got the ability with your legs straight, pull the toes back, you'll feel a good stretch behind the knee. The calf muscles and the hamstring muscles intertwine back there. So when you point your toe, it's easier. When you pull them back, it's much harder. Pull it in a little more. And now bring your face up to meet your knee. Pull your knee in towards your face, hold for 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And relax, put that left foot to the outside of your right knee. Use your right hand to grab the left knee and pull it across your body. Your left arm is flat on the floor, shoulder blade touching the floor. Keep pulling it downward. Don't hurt your back doing this though. All right, now relax it a little bit. Bring your leg up further towards your chest. So it's beyond 90 degrees of hip flexion. And now twist and pull it downward. Keeping the left arm down, left shoulder blade down. So most of the stretch is done with the thoracic spine and the hip. The lumbar spine is locked in a little bit. All right, relax, both knees bent. Put your left ankle on your right knee. Bring, grab your right thigh, bring it towards your chest. Feel the stretch in your left cheek. Gradually pull it in a little more. Now bring your face up to meet your shin. Pull your head up, pull the leg in, go deep into the glute. And we're done. Great job. How's everybody feel? Thank you, Irv. And I really appreciate the stretch at the end too. Nobody does that much on these. That's great. Oh, good. I appreciate you uh, acknowledging that. Now, take a short break. We've got to start over. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> can I reverse the film? I mean, how do I do this? You know? Uh, anyway, Ben, Cheyenne, how are y'all? Pretend a new beginning. Really or just pretend a new beginning. Right, right, right. We'll, we'll play the tape backwards. All right, this is the beginning <laughs> of the workout. Great job. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Irv. Thank you. Now, I think we're going to try this again on Thursday. We'll just have to see.
Everybody okay. cool? Cool. Yep. All Sounds right. good. Thank you all very much. Aaron, you're good? All right. All right. See you all there. Right. Thank you. Appreciate it. Good yeah. to see you, brother. Appreciate it. Right. Peace. My pleasure. It was fun. Take care. Thanks, Ben.